Venous thromboembolism, or VTE, is a major complication in patients with active cancer. Once it occurs, these patients often need indefinite anticoagulation. But here lies the challenge. Cancer patients are also at increased risk of bleeding. Striking the right balance between preventing clots and avoiding bleeding has always been tricky. A recent meta-analysis by Mahmoud and colleagues, published in the American Journal of Hematology in September 2025, reinforces the findings of the landmark API-CAT trial. This large study of 1,800 patients showed that low-dose apixaban, 2.5 mg twice daily, was just as effective as the full dose in preventing recurrent VTE, about 2.5% recurrence at one year, but came with significantly less clinically relevant bleeding, 12% versus 16%. The meta-analysis included one other smaller randomized trial with 360 patients showing nearly identical results. So, effectively, this strengthens our confidence that reduced dose apixaban works well for secondary VTE prophylaxis in cancer once patients have completed at least six months of full-dose anticoagulation. Now, what does this mean in clinical practice? For patients with active cancer who have finished six months of standard dose anticoagulation and are at ongoing risk of thrombosis, a low-dose apixaban regimen can be considered, especially for those with a history of bleeding or lower-risk thrombotic events such as distal or upper extremity DVT, incidental PE, or subsegmental PE. Could we extend this to other dopes like rivaroxaban? Possibly, but the evidence isn't as strong yet. And as always, caution is needed in patients with hematologic malignancies or brain tumors where bleeding risks may differ. In short, this study reassures us that stepping down the dose after six months may be the right move for many of our cancer patients. It's a small change that could make a big difference in reducing bleeding without compromising protection. I'm Davis, and that's your hematology update for today. Stay curious and keep evidence close to your practice.